fitting writing into your busy schedule is definitely, I think, something that holds a lot of people back. Early on, I heard somebody say, oh, you know, you should set aside 10 minutes a day to write. And so I tried that for a while and that didn't work for me. Um, I found that every time I went to sit down to write, I had to kind of backtrack and, and look where was I and where did I need to go. So I found my style is that I need to write in blocks of time. I've found that I need to just block the time on my calendar as I would any other meeting or any other work-related responsibility. And that's been a strategy that to me has been helpful. It's treating that time just like a priority, any other priority. If there's a meeting that you go to that's a priority, your writing has to assume the same priority as, as other things in your life. I also tend to be more effective with my writing earlier in the day. That may not be the same for everyone, but I think it's an awareness of when can you most be productive with your own writing. And I like to pick a time of day that I'm most productive. For me, that's early morning. That isn't, I know, for everybody. But um, so my, my thoughts on it are, in order to work it into your life, you need to make a commitment to it. You need to set your milestones and then find the style that works for you, whether it is the 10 minutes a day or whether you do need to set aside an hour or two every couple of weeks, if that is a better way for you to kind of get into the writing. I've told students that I've worked with too that even if you just, if you open that document, even if all you're doing is writing a new sentence or adding to your outline, that's still contributing, that's still moving forward, and it's something that you don't have to do the next time you open that document. For new authors fitting their writing into their schedule, I would say um, one is to schedule time, make time. And sometimes that schedule time doesn't work. You, you sit down and you've got nothing. And it's OK every once in a while to say, maybe not today, that you know I'm not going to be very productive. I think the other thing is to consider when you're writing, uh, maybe you don't have to write the first sentence first. For a lot of people, that is kind of a, is a little bit of a stumbling block. So it's like start wherever you feel most comfortable with your writing. And I think that helps you too to kind of stay motivated and feel like this is time well spent. One trick I do sometimes is I might put a sign on my door that says, you know, um, working on time related materials or something like that. I think if people know that it's protected time. Um, and, and you value it as much as you do other, other things that other people will protect it too. I just think you have to protect your time.